Welcome to Baller or Bust, where we test FIFA cards so you don't have to. Today we've got this squad with moments Jose Luis San Martin Mato, a.k.a. Joselu. Why did Real Madrid buy this guy? Is he even going to play? We acquired him via SBC for 102,000 coins. The good thing about this card, it's lengthy. The bad thing about this card, well, the dribbling. His pace is awesome with the lengthy, but he's a through-ball merchant and nothing more. He makes straight shoot through runs with his lengthy and high strength. It's great, because he's able to push off defenders and has good finishing. He's got five-star weak foot, which was good. But the bad side of it all is his dribbling just feels terrible. U7 by code Zaid, 6% off. The four-star skills don't feel smooth either. He's good at what he's built for, and that's being a target man. Good finishing in the box, good guy to have at the end of crosses. But his lack of dribbling ability just hurts his status big time. He's not as good as a guy like Chech or Darwizzi Nunez or other big man strikers. He's just not dynamic enough for this stage of the game. Would have been very good in, like, November. But now you need a player that can at least have some sort of dribbling ability to survive against all these tots deletes. Ruben Diaz, Militao, and so on. His shot also isn't insane to the levels where it makes up for it.